All right, all right. Let's do our first bike oil change and the first oil change on this brand new 2022 uh, XT250 Yamaha. Let's get our oil warm first. And stare at this little beauty. I really like this bike. It's been a lot of fun. Um, it was too tall for me at first, but it's been lowered. Um, yeah, it's a lovely little bike. Heavy bugger. Let's give her a little rev. Give her a little cold, cold rev. Alright, we're going to the manual. I'm a little bit late on my oil change, but that's okay. We won't tell anybody except for how I just told everybody. Get the right size tools out. Good old 12. Because they knew if it was a 10, you wouldn't be able to find it. Alright, gently, gently. It's pretty good. So you're going to drain all your oil. And uh, once it seems like it's getting much less oil, that's my dog, that's, that's Lugnut. He is, uh, he likes to work with me. But yeah, once, you, once all your oil seems like it's almost all drained, we're gonna like tip the bike a bit to see if we can get some more of that oil out. Now I'm only five foot nothing and like a hundred and some odd pounds. So like this bike's like 300 pounds almost. <laughs> So I'm just being really careful. I might not do a good job of doing this, but yeah. Still going. Still going, eh? <laughs> Sorry, that's my Canadian. I'll stop. All right, all right. Nice and clean. Get that stuff clean. You don't want to have a nasty mess. You don't want any leaks. cross thread your shit either. I got some new parts straight from the expensive store. <laughs> so just a new oil filter and some uh, Yamaha oil because I wanted to be cool like that. Now you're gonna see me do something that's a little like sketchy in all the uh, perfectionists and pretentious mindsets. But that's okay, I don't care. I'm just here to do my oil change and show you how I did it with the lack of tools. So cracking that with uh, the small handle on the Allen key wrench is really hard, and especially for my little hands. So I just cracked it just barely with that pipe and then did all rest by hand. So eat it. <laughs> bought this bike brand new. Um, it was pretty cool. I, I waited like six months for it. It's the newest thing I've ever owned in my life. And uh, it was cool to know that they, you know, took it out of a box and built it for me and rode it home brand spanking new. <laughs> was not prepared for the oil to come out of this. Oh yeah, don't forget which bolts go where. Make sure you put them in a great spot so you don't forget. Or take a photo, whatever helps you remember.
recording two things at once here, so. <laughs> I'm just like, oh, right, oil. <laughs> it's okay. We all like to get a little dirty when we're working on our machines, right? Look how cute and new and pretty it is. It's so cute, it's teeny. I'm very new to bikes. Like, I only just started to ride a bike, uh, a, a dirt bike, uh, like three years ago. So I'm very new at this. Grease oil, your little uh, O-ring gasket there that you saw, the little rubber thing, it's just good to, to oil it, like anything like in a car even. Looks like I'm making a mess, but that's okay. While I'm trying to record, record. It's a tough job, double recording. You have no idea. Definitely have to have an ADHD mind, I think. these down again um, I I know you shouldn't be using a uh, very a small and specific uh, torque wrench for this probably I think it's supposed to be like nine Newton meters of torquing these um, I think uh, definitely do your research but I'm I've worked on cars for a really long time and just tightening this uh, part uh, just just tightened enough is gonna be fine so I'm not cranking it with the bar and I'm again I'm only five foot nothing and I don't weigh a lot so I'm not putting a lot of pressure in this but I am making sure that it's snug one more sketchy pass make you all cringe <laughs> your 14 mil because we're going to fill her up. Make sure that's clean too. Everything's got to be as clean as it came out. If it wasn't clean when it came out, make it clean. This is not the proper filling neck or filler, whatever. It's, it's definitely incorrect, but that's all I could find. So we're gonna do it and we're gonna see how long it takes us doing it this way. <laughs> The book will tell you how much oil it's going to take. Um, if, if I can remember, I think it was like 1.2 or 1.3 liters, um, but you have to double check. Oh, 1.3. See? There, there's my hand, my sign language there. <laughs> And 
then go for a rip. Thanks for watching. I wasn't trying to impress anybody. I was just trying to show you how to change the oil in one of these new bikes. So go and have fun. Bye.